hello, hello, it's Nader Gator, back with you for this flight we're doing from Houston Intercontinental to New Orleans. I t decided to shake it up a little bit. I'm flying with some friends from the FS Fly Boys community, uh, or at least they're on the Discord for that, um, or the Discord channel for that. Uh, but we're flying on the Batsim Network. Got some traffic here at Houston. We got some controllers online. Should be a fun experience. And apparently we're also on the default default frequency excuse me sorry that's weird anyways guys i hope you enjoy and i'm going to go ahead and uh undeafen as uh the discord um thing puts it so that we can uh, kind of hear uh our guys we're flying with throughout <coughs> generating briefing package Processing. 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 Generating nav log. Building maps. Done. Redirecting to output. FSX plan, please. Gate 1944. Moving to document. Discretion across the mark center section at and maintain 13,000 San Antonio altimeter is 299 Okay, so today I will actually be using a ground chart this time. On the uh, Mark's night arrival, across the Mark's intersection. So we, don't, so we don't have another incident like last night. Well, yeah, okay. Uh, down to, um, yeah, I think you remember that. Oh yeah. Let's get to uh, Houston Approach. Who's on? Oh, it's Matthew. Uh, one, two, All right, I'm pushing back. Already? Already? Jesus, dude. Just relax, all right? No, like, I was expecting, like, a good long wait, like we had in, in uh, Portland last night, Execu, but, I mean, I asked for it. He didn't even ask me if, he didn't ask me if I wanted to sit or anything. He's just like, yep, nope, you're cleared. Here's your squawk. Here you go. Yep, I'm going to call him real quick. Now I gotta try not to back into this building. So we were going to use the, oh, we did 120.5. I'm an idiot. 120.05. You still here? Was on. Yeah, I'm still here. Uh, still here. Yeah, I'm on the There we go. And we have. Do you fly the real Air Duke? The... What? Do you fly the real Air Duke? No. Houston departure United twelve twenty four ready for taxi. If information United twelve twenty four and one five left taxi via uh, uh, Charlie November Echo whiskey whiskey Houston altimeter two nine 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 or two nine 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 is the altimeter as we just heard. Go Sorry, you kind of broke up a little bit. Can you repeat taxi instruction? Sure, no problem. Runway 15 left. Taxi via November Charlie. November Echo. Whiskey Whiskey. Houston altimeter 2 9 or 9 or 9 or. At KIH. Taxi 2 and hold shorter 15 left using taxi ways. November Charlie. November Echo. Whiskey Whiskey. Altimeter 2 9 or 9 or 9 or. I'll go ahead and look up the route here real quick for. I used to live in New Orleans, uh, I had to connect in Houston all the time. I mean, Houston approaching, I mean, 2-9 stone on the ground here now, uh, on the 
Looking for the IFR to New Orleans. Alright, gate B91. I don't think they have ritual to stuff like this route anymore. Or if they do, they're not. Oh, it's United CRJs. 297 on the ground at Bush. Yeah, uh, yeah, they actually have CRJ 700s, uh, but not 200s. It's mostly 320s and uh, 737, uh, various 737 aircraft. United 297, I'm not sure on the flight plan for There we go. Looks Thank you, quit pushing. Aw, oh, dead, aw, oh, dead, died. Yeah, United 297, well, disregard just showed up. Uh, I thought it was a ready to copy Ivy Clarence. It's pretty funny. Um, actually, because I don't know what air I can have, so I'm going to make sure I can do the mugs in there. I, I know I can do the aw, oh, dead, but I'm going to make sure I can do the mugs before I put that in. Uh, we are Sky West 60, I think we're 6514. Yeah, 65. Uh, Virtue, holding, uh, holding position, uh, United 297, push back right in front of me. There we go. And execute that. United 1224, Roger, uh, check your handle whenever you get a chance. Oh, we should probably actually. Do we have Roger, I'll, I'll try and finally your handle when I get a chance. United 1224. Yeah, we have the mugs. Sweet. And it's the mugs for us, so we're good to go. Let's go ahead and send a flight plan. Uh, yeah, I don't have to. <laughs> X squawk box, man, X squawk box. KIH. Amazon. I always like to set my alternate really close to. Is that you right there, Friendman? Kenu. Uh, right by me? Front. Yeah. You taxi. You, you pushed back right in front of Bro, I'm sorry. I thought you were AI, so, yeah. If I knew that was you, I wouldn't have done it. <laughs> I even said it, but you were muted. I like I even tried uh, like calling out on Discord and hey, put stop, stop pushing, stop pushing. But no, you were you were muted, so I couldn't. Yep, yeah, sorry. I was talking to the briefer. We're good though. I don't have to talk to him again. Sure, that's not what gate they use there, but whatever. Uh, so once that, we'll let that, we'll give that a few minutes to go through, and then we'll call up uh, departure for clearance. So I just submitted my flight plan, and I'm going to call up for clearance here in a few minutes once I make sure it goes through. Okay. Uh, bugs. Uh, actually, we'll, yeah, call for clearance first because I have no idea what. Uh, when we were your first up at Tender 1 ready for taxi, runway 1 2 right ahead. South West 10 0 1 runway 1 2 right, taxi via Yankee Echo, cross runway 1 2 left, cross runway 1 7, hobby altimeter 2 9 9 9. Push your right via Yankee Echo, cross 1 2 left, cross 1 7, 2 9 9 9 on the altimeter, South West 10 0 1. Probably 1 5 to left. Then there's Niner right there, but screw Niner. <laughs> Screw Niner. Pretty much. Unless it's that boss. United two ninety seven Houston approach out copy. It's probably one five left, but we'll see. Yeah, we're ready to go ahead with the Alright, United two ninety seven, you're clear to New Orleans via the Gummy three departure like Charles transition, then the spinal yeah, final maintain four thousand, spec level two seven zero one like zero it. minute departure. I like it. Departure yeah. is with me. Squawk four six six seven. In the 1997 third in New Orleans, the W3 Lake Charles transition in the smile. Uh, it's departure climbing cage 7000, make 6070, one three minutes after. Departure with you, 4667 in the box. United 297, the initial altitude is 4000. Y'all flying on fat sim right now. Apologies, uh, United. Yes, that by. We're calling. Alrighty, United 2. Uh, correction, United 297, nope. read back, correct, advise ready to taxi, push back and start at pilot's discretion, you can expect runway 15 left. Yep, ready taxi, 15 left, United 297. 
United 297, Runway 15 left, taxi via November Charlie, November Echo, Whiskey, Whiskey, Houston Altimeter, yeah. 299er, 99er. Joshua. 15 left, yeah. November Charlie, November Echo, Whiskey, G'day. Whiskey, uh, G'day. G'day. Houston departure, Sky West 6514 IFR to New Orleans. Houston departure sky was 6514 IFR to New Orleans. Yeah, I was 6514. My apologies, I was getting clearance up. I've got it ready when you're ready to copy. We're ready to copy 6514. Sky was 6514. You're clear to New Orleans via the mug support of departure, grassy transition, and it's filed. Climb and maintain 4000. Expect flight level 290 010 minutes after departure. Departures with me, squawk 4632. All right, initial altitude 4000 at squawk 4632 for Skyway 6514. Skyway 6514, read back correct. Advise ready to taxi, push back and start a pilot's discretion. You can expect runway 15 left. 6514, we'll go. Southwest 1001, hobby winds 180 at 5 on departure, fly runway heading, runway 12 right, clear for takeoff. Runway heading, uh, clear for takeoff on when she writes off with Andrew. I think with this aircraft. Uh, anyway, let's try that again. There we go. United 297, if you could yeah, check your we'll transponder for me, I'd appreciate it. I'd still show you squawk so and VFR, but mode Charlie. Charlie. Stand by, I, um, uh, I have it to 4667. Let me recycle it for you for 297. So, 15 left, that's where we're expected to depart. Due to mugs. Houston approach United 630 requesting IFR clearance to Austin. United 630, you're cleared to the Austin Burks from Airport via the Mendito 5 departure. Manure transition and file. I maintain 4,000. Expect flight level 2210 minutes after departure. Departure to me. Squawk 4660. Clear to the Austin Airport. Uh, that's file via the Mendito 5 uh, departure. Manure transition. Uh, climbing into initial altitude of 4,000 feet, expecting two flight level 220, one zero minutes departure, departure frequency with you, and squawk 4660. United 630, read back, correct, push back, and start a pilot's discretion, advising ready to taxi, and expect runway 15 left. Push back to our discretion, we'll advise and ready to taxi, expecting 15 left, United 630. <laughs> There, there really is a waypoint after all that. It just goes United 297. The, uh, the Houston wind 180 at 7, 7 on departure. Or have to carbon or only 15 left. Clear to take off. Clear to take off. Uh, Remy 15 left. Uh, yeah, on have to carbon for United 297. Probably landing 11 and departing uh, 20. I don't know. I haven't flown out in the world since forever. Either way, though. So yeah, we got that in. Southwest uh, 1001, radar contact, 1,600, climbing maintain 16,000. Proceed direct Z18. Climbing maintain 16,000, okay. direct Z, uh, Southwest 1001. Uh, so we'll find the bugs. Let's take a look at that real quick. So, departing to 15, so we go to TAPS, which I think is in here. Yeah, TAPS. Uh, Bottle, which is there, and then mugs. And then since we're going to Gusty, we're flying to Hops, J, Spiny, and Gusty. So yeah, that's all in there. So we're we are looking good to go. We gotta be below four thousand at taps and below five thousand at bottle. Let's go ahead and set up for four thousand. 
I think you could have just like climb by sit or would have the same effects because we have to be under 4,000 anyways. Either way, 4,000. Uh, turn the flight directors on. Uh, speed, I'll just do manually because that's how this plane rolls, yo. Uh, we'll United In Houston, departure United 297 with you, comments at 1104 in the Cartman. Still haven't really gotten back to United 297, radar really contact 1100, climb uh, and maintain 16000 upon departure. Up to 16000, uh, United 297. United 1224, Houston 120 at 7 on departure, turn left, heading 090, runway 15 left, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, 15 left, uh, turn left, heading 090. Actually, no, that's a right way. Contact Houston 7, now 126.95. See ya. Over center, have a great night. Southwest 10 0 And use an approach, United 30, ready to taxi. Yeah, he's in the first second. Was that United 630? Hey, from United 630, ready to taxi. United 630, runway 15 left taxi. Via November, Charlie, November Echo, whiskey, whiskey, Houston 1399. Strobe light on. Strobe light on. November, Charlie, November Echo, whiskey, whiskey. You know what started with your career during the chat? Because that's kind of the end of the Yeah. So, on the pay. Where's that? We've been there before. Departure, departure with me, squawk 4642. Oh, my pay goes. It says banks. Oh, American 1579, read back yeah. direct. Advise them ready to taxi. You can expect only one five left. One five left, call for taxi. United 1224, you can proceed direct. Like Charles, when able, call in one six thousand. Climbing 16,000 and proceeding to Lake Charles Theodore. Yeah. Yeah. Good to me. Alright. 
United 297, contact Houston Center now, 126.95. See ya. Over to Center, 126.95. Have a great night, uh, United 297. Houston departure, Sky 165.14, ready for taxi, 15 left. Sky West 6514, runway 15 left, taxi V November, Charlie November, Echo Whiskey Whiskey. Follow, actually, you just follow the United, the United uh, A320 next to you that'll be heading that way. Alright, we'll follow the United A320 November, Charlie November, Echo, and Whiskey Whiskey for Sky West 6514. Uh, he's an approach. We're currently behind the CRJ. Should we step up front or should we follow the CRJ? Well, if you can get out first, feel free to lead. If not, we can have Sky West lead. Either works for me, United 63. All right, Sky West 6514, taxi via the previous instructions. Break, United 630, follow the Sky West CRJ. Exactly, I see you. I see your wing lights anyway. Following Amazing. Sky J215. Let me see if I can spot you. I'm like right behind you. United 1224. Yeah. I don't see you. Six point five. Have a good flight. Hey, GA. Pilot. Contacting 126.5 for United 1224. Have a good night. See you. Have some fun with those two on the ground. 126.9 or five. Sorry, 126.9 or five. United 369, Romeo, do it. November 369, Romeo, do it. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're all stuffed with a capital. Uh, capital. Like capital. We're, 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 stuffed with, we're all stuffed with a capital F. Yeah, that's what he's That's just that's 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 an Australian huh? say. We're all stuffed with a capital F. In other words, fuck. Juliet, uh, <laughs> I know. If today, you say, oh, if, if they do better than us. Exactly, you getting turbulence? Yeah. Was that? Yeah, that wasn't bad, right? The uh, invitation. Okay. Yeah, I'm, get, I'm getting bumped around a little bit too, so I was making sure. It's not bad. What altitude would you like to fly at? Yeah, I, I just got switched over to center, so that's about referenced how far apart we are. I could have. I want to get up. I got suspended on the was naughty, but uh, uh, I, I never find that the Australian. Does anyone else go on to New Orleans? Yeah, what's up? Oh, you're going? Uh, what's your call sign? I'm, I'm the Sky West guy. Okay. Oh, you're the Sky West I've been talking about? Iowa 6514, Houston with 180 at 7 on departure. Are now to taps. Good evening, Arizona 5299. I are now to. I are now to taps. Runway 15 left, clear for takeoff. Uh, United, uh, excuse me, Sky with 6514. Houston approach, good evening, I set up 6299. 13.3 for uh, 9000, crossing H town, 9000, H town to arrival. Major, you still on the ground? Air shuttle 6299, Roger, he's down. Roger, okay, me and him are. Me and Execu are pretty much right behind each other, so. I left two success to approach for uh, set up 6299. Yeah, November United was not my airline of choice. Piper 369, Romeo, Julie, I really uh, wanted to join American, but they had no positions available. Uh, 
Uh, those, those. Can you repeat that, Executive? I missed it. ATC started talking right as soon as you started. Yeah, I was just saying, United is not my airline of choice. If I would have been able to join one, I would have joined American Virtual, but they had no positions available. I, if if I were to do an actual airline, I probably would do Southwest. Yeah, Southwest didn't have any positions available either. Are you just complaining saying they couldn't hear anything because we were talking? Mm, no, because ATC, I'm that's him, not you guys. All right, I thought you couldn't hear because we were talking. Okay. Um, um, do any of you guys have the uh, Beechcraft Duke? Nope. I think really? I think the only I think the only person you can talk to for that is Hunter. Or Yuki, but he's not on either. Yeah. Nader, you still have to leave me that that channel. I'm having a really weird problem with it, and I'm looking to solve it. But thanks, anyways. <laughs> What's the problem, anyhow? Piper on the ground, take position. Uh, I want it as well, but it was Brandman and me. Yeah, Executive and Brandman. How often do you post? You do like po like every time you fly, or not every time, but just in a case, like group flights and events and stuff. I'll typically do. Oh, sweet. So you, it seems like though you're so far behind that you're just gonna be hearing us talking and ATC and everything, and we're just, we're just gonna be sitting on the ground watching you. <laughs> United 6:30. There you are. Sorry about that. Yeah, I I even waited a while to ta like for my taxi because I let ex Executjet go by because I had I got really confused on yeah, sorry about that. taxi ways from, because uh, like for some reason they now. can't go in alphabetical uh, order. It'd be too simple. Not a problem. I mean that 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 really just threw me for a curveball right there. It's like. One more left over take off United 6:30. All right, thanks. You no, know, it's like let's just go from November Delta to November Fox Drive, then to November X. Forget, forget alphabetical order. Which is what I was going off was alphabetical order. That's why I turned that way in the first place because my chart was absolutely useless. Zero to send and maintain six thousand vectors to the ILS runway. Correction, vectors to ILS runway two six. I know that now. I know that now. <laughs> Alright, right heading. Some of those bigger airports. Right like heading zero and uh, down to six thousand. That's what I'm Yeah. Well, the one I, the one I found was just absolutely useless. It didn't. It was yeah. It was bad. <laughs> you now have four subscribers. Nice. I really, I really enjoy having four subscribers. You have five. You have five now. You've almost doubled your subscriber count. <laughs> okay, I figured out the problem within like five seconds of searching the internet. <laughs> Congrats to you. Yep. Oh, hey, Executive Jet. My, my 
Ultimate are automatically switched over to 299 or 2 and when I broke 18,000. Uh, you are very I, lucky. I didn't even have to do it, it just automatically did it for me. Congrats. I wish my plane did that. Oh wait, I fly Airbus. Yep. Two words. Crash detection. Alright, so, Executive Jet, me and you are 10 miles apart. Skywest 6514 through 11100 for 16000. Skywest 6514 Houston Center, good evening, sir. Climb maintain flight level 290, and if you would for me, recycle your trans transponder clock 297, descend pilot's discretion when you're ready, cross uh, on that at 112250 now, and uh, give me a call out of flight level 270. But... I'll give you a call when I'm descending down to 11000, uh, we'll cross on that there at 11000 and 200 knots, 390. from when we need to send. Well, this is New Orleans, like seriously, I mean, I'm probably going to start descending after I hit Lake Charles, which is in 27 miles, and then I'll start descending down. Really? Oh yeah, because you have to hit all dead at 11,000, and that's only 13 miles from the runway. Or 13 miles from the beginning of the ILS approach, runway 11. I guess you're doing ILS 11, or it's, uh, one zero. it's, it's one zero for me. It's technically 11, but I don't know. I don't know. Yet. Okay. That's how they do it. Good luck with all those all the aircraft coming to get them and leaving Houston or wherever they're going. And well, we're we're we're, we're heading pretty much due east, so one one will be easy for us. Well, kind of yeah, no Airbus. Yeah. Well, I do think though that I'm gonna take one roll well, it's one zero for me, but I'm gonna take that because it's it's more straight in from where we're going or from where we're heading. We're heading pretty much due east. That do you fly New Orleans a lot? No. I used to live in New Orleans, so yeah, I fly Uh yes. Very nice. I also I'm just gonna I'm just gonna like ask for ILS of one one. Yeah, I fly to New Orleans all the time. I know the approach is like the back of my hand. Yeah, because it's cause great if, place. New Orleans. If, if Ada says, you know, they're landing 1 1 and 2 0, then that means I have an option of what I want to land on. I want to land on 1 1, so give me 1 1. I mean, wow. I mean te technically, yes. Like, you could always just suggest that you want to land the server in Wicho, but he's going to give you 1 1 anyways, because the way to do it is everyone on the odd data arrival gets 1 1, and everybody on Because the rhythm puts you on the ILS, or not the ILS, the localizer for 2 0 the same way the uh, uh, ODET puts you on the localizer for 1 1. And then when they land runway 2, all bets are off. They 
much just get to do whatever the hell they want. Jerry's a race car driver. They used to, uh, they used to not land 2-0 a lot. They used to, like, land 1-1 one, one all the time at the part 1-1 one, one and 2. But, or at least, I, like, I don't remember ever landing 2-0 all the times I've flown in. Okay, so what are you taking as a you? Um, I'm taking 1-1 one, one in. That's okay. what I normally take. There's a Did any of you guys still fly on F -S or MS flight at all? Not in a while. Yeah. Yeah, I mean MS flights. Okay. Catching up, execu. Catching up, execu. Boston Virtual. That's in Vetson, right? Yeah, they merged. I used to fly in control over there. Nader, that is a beautiful Southwest. Jerry's a race contract. That beautiful one. Southwest 1325 radar contact. Southwest, Southwest Airlines. Miles northwest of the Alexandria VOR, play level 390. Did you want to keep it there or go up to 410? I like it much better than the old um, one. Um, we need to refile it at uh, flight level 390. Uh, what was it? Southwest 1325. Roger, no problem, sir. I can take care of refiling that for you. I wanted to know what you wanted to do. I'll, uh, I'll put the... Oh, yeah. The, I have the vomit bar. The two... The deliveries that I like, I like the new one. And I like the uh, state livery. Does anybody have a Canyon Blue livery or a free work Canyon Blue Southwest? No, I got the the only the only one I have is I have the Lone I have Lone Star one. I have the new one. I tried looking. PMPG. Uh, it. No, it's this freeware. Mine's TDS freeware. The TDS. Where do you get that yeah. from? I've always wanted to get TDS. I've heard they make pretty good uh, freeware add-ons. It's Inviation. For freeware, they're good. For, for freeware, they're good. But, I mean, like, you put them up against PMDG or whatever, and it doesn't, stand, it doesn't, it doesn't you know, even make a wind. But, for freeware, TDS makes good 737s. Alright, I'll, I'll have to go check them. Yeah, uh, synviation.com. Okay, um, I think, uh, I think I have a American Airlines from them. I've got... An American Airlines, I've got an Alaska 738, I've got an Alaska 739, I've got a Southwest, I've got a United. See, they have Southwest uh, 737s there, but the ones they have are the uh, shark, no, not sharklets, they have the, uh, the scimitars, the uh, one with lit up and one with lit down. Uh, I don't want that version, I want the old version. Uh, I, think, I think the one, I don't think the one I have is a split winglet, I think I have a, I think I have a normal winglet. I used I used to have a split winglet. I liked it, and then I stopped flying it, so I got rid of it. But I got a I got a different one, and I think it's just the regular winglet that goes up. I don't think it's a split. Where do you get it from? Simviation. I get all my seven thirty sevens from Simviation. Hey, Brandman, why are you flying so fast on that seven thirty seven? Why are you flying so slow? Because I'm in an A three nineteen, and uh, yeah, same exactly. Go American. I would love to go American, but oh yeah, American manufactured. How about joint German, British, French, blah 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 blah. E ads. Europe stuff. <laughs> Just basically yep. Europe. Europe in general, like the Bulgarians made this Canada, nut from the wheel, and huh? no, no one cares about Canada. Boot Canada. No, no one cares Canada. about Canada. Canada would be more Boeing because it's like because the, the two main factories are in Seattle. So Canada, Canada be pro Boeing. I don't know. Air Canada sure does operate a lot of Airbuses. Okay, so does Virgin America and JetBlue. And American, they operate a lot. They seem to operate a lot of uh, them too since the uh, U.S. Airways merger. So the spirit. Ryanair has. Wait, no, they have just seven three. Yeah, right. Right, Ryanair and Southwest are basically the same thing. Just one's American, one's European. Um, EasyJet. Uh, no. 
one, yeah, the one, one lands on yeah, crashes. Have some, <laughs> <laughs> well, you mean, I mean in terms of like, what their basis is, you know. Low cost. Yeah, and 737 all. Basically, Southwest is the American version of, um, hang on a sec. Yeah, basically, Southwest is the American version of Ryanair. Virgin America and JetBlue are the American versions of EasyJet. Pretty much every airline in Europe is a low-cost carrier, just because there's so much competition. Pretty much. Except for uh, BA. Oh my god, British Airways. Love them. A former uh, Concord operator is going to give them some credit. He's never cleared me to descend. Ah, uh, screw it. Who needs <laughs> controllers? <laughs> he never cleared me to descend. And I just heard the controller. Who needs them? Flight level 270 for 11,000. Am I right? Are you right? That's a, that, that's a, really, that's a good question, actually. Copy, 297. United 297, one more thing, you can expect the ILS runway 11 approach. Only for the ILS 11 in for United 297. And United 1224, descending maintain 10,000. Descending maintain 10,000, United 1224. United 1224, you'll have traffic at your 12 o'clock, 5 miles. Turn right heading uh, 100 for traffic. Turning right one zero zero for everybody in the company. Where are you guys uh, flying to? New Orleans. New Orleans. New Orleans. There New Orleans. Twenty seven. You're leaving Myers Space to the North Fort Worth Center is not available. Mardi Gras. I know. <laughs> Execu, did you hear me? What? Mardi Gras? No, no, no. I said. uh... uh so turning right one zero zero for friend for buddy in the company. <laughs> Wow. Yes, yes we will. I'm up for that. My airplane likes to shake. American 717, you're leaving my airspace to the north. Fort Worth Center is not available. Radar service is terminated. Good to change. Preview have a good flight. Bye, have a beautiful time, thank like you, Jet. I'll wait to you as I go by. Hey, where are you guys uh, tuned on to now? What radio? Or uh, what frequency? Uh, Houston Center. Houston Center, alright. Uh, yeah, Executive Jet, I am 4.6, uh, off to your 3 right now. Actually, more like your 4 or 5. Searching, searching, searching. Aha, there you are. Actually, yeah, like, more like 5 o'clock right now. <laughs> See, your fast Boeing made you do a diversion for traffic, so you know what? Sometimes the fastest doesn't win the race. Slow and steady does. Oh yeah, because the whole twenty degrees made that much of a difference. Yep, that's like ten minutes. And United twelve twenty four, you can also expect ILS runway one one and to New Orleans. Roger, ILS one one in New Orleans. United twelve twenty four. And actually it just lines me up better for the runway. Because I'm pretty much going head on right now. Oh, okay. Ooh. 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 Ooh.
Oh boy! That guy is being possessed. <laughs> yeah. What guy? Yeah, I thought that was the guy sounded like he was coughing up a lung there. Pretty weak there. <laughs> yeah, the guy sounded like he was hacking up a lung. Bologna sandwich. Southwest, somebody's really doing that. Yeah. There's also Virgin 69. Yeah. Virgin 69. Yeah. I'm gonna do Hawaii 5 0. <laughs> huh. Huh. On, um, book, on 4th of July. On, no, on, on 4th of, uh, 4th of, uh, on 4th of July, I did American 1776. Radar yeah. contact, uh, about 33 miles nice. My favorite one is November uh, Delta Lima March Delta Tango Romeo Papa. Huh. Much funny. Yeah, you guys are tuned in the Houston Center right now, right? Yeah. We're all in Houston Center. Houston. Ho Houston. I'm just trying to be cool for the YouTube guys. Don't judge me. I see. I see Nader back. I see Nader on the. Um, that spy. And holy crap, he's behind. He's not even out of Texas yet. Oh. Actually, yeah, he is. He's out of yeah, Texas. Yeah. Oh, are you? Oh, okay. And United 297, continue your descent all the way down to uh, Voodoo at 4,000 for me. Did you guys just get that uh, no, United transmission? What? The United transmission telling them to just send down to Voodoo or whatever? Yeah, that yeah, was, that was me. for That was yeah. for execution. Yep. Okay. I'm just making sure I'm on the right page here. Yeah, yeah, you're good. Uh, yeah, yeah, 1224 is me, 297 is execu, and then Skywest 6514 is there, is a uh, name. Alright. I sure hope I can make this descent, noting that I'm going 2400 feet a minute down, and I'm only at 12,800 feet, and I'm going 275 knots. I tried to. I told you you had to descend early. No, wait. Of course I waited, and then look what happened. I have full speed brakes. Well, technically, yes, for this plane to go down. Because this plane just loves to float, and I don't know why. Other than that, highly recommend the plane. It's great. <laughs> I recommend this plane. It's better than all the other planes. Hi. I'm a non-paid attorney spokesperson. <laughs> I'm high. Head on. Apply directly below the floor. I don't get it. Was. You remember those commercials that aired back in like 2006? Uh, okay, no, I can't really eight, remember. Five, fourteen, within house discretion, cross the odd at, uh, at... One one eleven thousand two five zero knots, and uh, give me a call out of flight level two nine or zero. All right, I'll add up one one thousand two five zero. I'll give you a call out of flight level two nine or zero. Skywest six five fourteen. Wow. <laughs> I want to talk really fast because some controllers talk really fast, so I counter it by talking really fast, and no one understands. That's really funny either. Seven at Voodoo, you're cleared the ILS runway one one approach, and uh, just report Voodoo inbound. Did, was that for me? Did anyone catch that? Yeah, that was, uh, that was for executives. <laughs> yeah, report voodoo. We'll look at here and sit down for the voodoo will report inbound. Okay, so. As opposed to reporting outbound on voodoo. That is 1224, fly heading at 360, instead of maintain 8,000 vectors for spacing. Turning to 360. 
zero to sending eight thousand vectors for spacing twenty four. Twenty four. Yeah, he's coming in the opposite direction, though. If they put him in 2 0, then. Well, he might come in our. No, no. He, 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 said, he, he said that he wanted a 1 1. Oh, great. Southwest 420, that sounds much better, sir. Thank you. 420. Southwest 420, no scope. It sounds much better. Yeah, okay. Hey, Southwest 420, proceed okay. direct slack, YOLO. Okay, so he said. Um, Sinner said, are you able to take the visual runway 2-0? He said, we prefer ILS-1-1. He said, roger. Um, he said, thank you. He yeah. said, are you able to take the visual 2-0? I said, bitch, where? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just had to be training. Uh, where this is uh, Air Force 1. We have like to request. Oh my god, we have Air Force 1. No. No. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, my God. <laughs> no. Oh, my God. Tell me it's not true. Oh, my God. We need to figure Is he out really doing to... this? No, we, we need to figure out which airport this guy's at. I'm looking. <laughs> he's I'm gonna already get looking. fucking kicked off. If, he, if he's at New Orleans, I'm turning around right now. No. No, he's not. Okay. Good. He's not even in Houston even Center. No, I don't either. Unless he's one of those insta spawners on the runway and just starts calling. <laughs> he's probably trolling. He went to all the secretive Area 51 shots. Yeah, he's <laughs> down there at the Naval Air Station in New Orleans. Southwest 1224, turn right heading uh, <laughs> 090 to 718 5000. He just ignored him. <laughs> <laughs> I think he says Southwest 1224. United 1224, turn right, heading 090 to send a maintain 5000. Roger, turning right 090, maintaining 5000. By the way, you called me Southwest earlier, not United. Jeez. Yep, I caught that, thank you. Yeah, that was very rude of you. No, I don't see him on the map either. I think he's just trolling. for the company, and, uh... We're heading direct all that now. We're down. Okay, United 297, Roger. <laughs> Just let him know. Huh? About to, about to be over Lafayette. Lafayette International Airport. I'm sorry, it's regional. So. Lafayette. <laughs> Lafayette. As everyone from here calls it, Lafayette. Not laughing. Brandon Johnson. Is that you, Brandon? No. No, I'm not sure about that. No. We've got some idiotic voices in our ear right now. We've got Richard. Okay, West 6514, the New Orleans Alphonse. Nathan, Brandon, and then Thomas. I expect that was 1 1. We have the altimeter sky with 6514. Wow, idiotic voices? Okay. Wow. Like, well, wow. Talking and it was so obvious the transmission I was directed at. Oh, I wouldn't pay it. I wouldn't pay attention to that, so I didn't hear it for you. Uh, Air Force 10 too, which I can kind of do, sir. Southwest uh, 420, it's going to maintain uh, 5,000. Do what? After Mark, and uh, when you reach the Chris intersection... I'm sorry, can you say that again? I... I... Oh, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't need to. Yeah, Air Force 10, that's not me. Houston Center, Delta 2476, okay. just out of New Orleans, out 4000. Yeah, no, because the matching didn't call signs or anything. Don't mean anything. Because, yeah, the matching call signs right, don't mean anything. Uh, 310 for Delta 2476. 
what would happen if you went in as Air Force One? Would they just ignore you, or they try to ban you, or what? I I don't know. I haven't heard anything else, any other transmissions from Air Force One, so I mean. Well, I saw a guy come on an Air Force One way back when here on Batsum, and they just made him change call signs. And Delta 2476, go ahead and call in 0900 for now. I'll have you uh, direct to your Green County momentarily. All right, that was that was in Philadelphia, I believe. One of the few times I fly or flew up in the Northeast. <laughs> Probably. It's probably some guy who's probably really drunk. Hey, United 297, <laughs> have some fun. Once you reach uh, Voodoo, you're clear the ILS runway 1 1 approach. Clear ILS 1 1 after Voodoo, 39 297. And United 1224, turn right heading 100. Sorry, can you repeat that? You broke up on the first number. United 1224, Roger, no problem, sir. Turn right, I think, 100. Turning right, 100, United 1224, thank you. Delta 2476, turn left, heading uh, 045, direct Green County, resume on that. Zero four five on a heading direct to Green County, we're zooming now. Delta twenty four thirty two. I saw that there was a guy that before that came in or I heard the story that there was a guy that came in on a, in the Trump seven fifty seven, he got banned. <laughs> but what's funny was hey, he was flying out of Dallas. I would understand it more if he was flying like out of California, but out of Dallas. Why did he get banned? I just don't understand. Did uh, Hunter come and that sim and did that once? Uh, no, he did it on the server. With, uh, like, Yuki as Tower. Oh, I remember that. It was about a week ago, I remember he did that. Yeah. Snowdog almost came in, you know when New York was having their event? Over in, over in, like, New Jersey and Boston, New York area? Yeah. Yeah, so New Newark what and New Jersey was absolutely jam packed. Oh, hang on. Twenty miles from Voodoo, flighting one zero zero, and maintain five thousand until established. You're clear to ILS runway one one approach number two. Clear to ILS one one number two, and we'll uh, we'll call one one five three. So twenty four. Yeah. So when they were having their event, in New Jersey. And New York was fully staffed, and so we almost, almost got Snowdog to come in as Air Force One and shut down in the whole airport. Fully staffed, <laughs> lined up out the wazoo of approaches and departures. We almost made him shut down the entire airport. The Wapple Two arrival to Hobby Altimeter is three zero zero zero. Yeah, that would have been amazing. But he backed out the last second. Yeah, I remember that too. I was there. You, you told me to come. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Um, executive jet speed. Uh, 205 indicated. Sp right. uh, slowing to 185, though. Roger, I'm doing 240 right now. Probably yeah. be slowing down to 210 here in a sec. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's that perfect time right now. They haven't turned the runway lights on. And um, I can barely see it out in the distance. You have, you have the tone? Say again? Do you have, do you have ILS tone? Localizer? Yeah. Just, right. I'm just trying to get the glide slope. Right, okay, I haven't got that yet. And I got the glide slope. Neat. 
Who's flying the uh, SkyWest flight? 9297, contact New Orleans Tower at 1119 or 25, have a great night. What's that? Oh, that's a task. 119 or 25, have a great night. Skywest 6514, continue your descent all the way down to 8,000 for me. 8,000, I still haven't picked up the tone yet. 109.9, I believe, is the frequency. No, I mean, I've got the frequency in. I just got it. And yeah, I drove 24 as well, boys. United 1224, Roger cleared to uh, ILS. Piers coming down. Or, correction, 1-1. The runway's Roger, inside. Uh, one, one, nine, 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 nine. <laughs> we the United 518, we are about 15 miles west of the Ono VOR, descending to flight level 278 on the Driller 5 with Golf. 518 Heavy, good evening, sir. Reset transponder, squawk 4732. Alright, alright, I've got localizer. At 518. So I think Executive Jet's on tower, and me, me and Nader are still on center. Yeah. But I'm about I'm about to be, radar contact. I'm about to be flipped over to tower. Five eighteen heavy radar contact. Uh, looks like you're descending through flight level two six zero. Descend via the driller five arrivable. And the current uh, bush altimeter is three zero zero one. Descend via the driller five. Five eighteen. Okay, with 65, 14, we can continue to spin all the way down to 5. Yeah, he's not that great. The ILS runway, one, one approach to His tomorrow. mic is insane. What was that? His mic is insane. Oh, God. Good luck. Alright. Southwest 420, depart uh, the Chris intersection heading 300, just in a main for 1000. We'll turn right at Chris. 300 will descend, maintain 3000 right now. So, you guys still all on center, are you guys? Uh... I'm on tower, the restaurant center. Yeah, I'm about to flip over to tower, though, I think. Is that Air uh, Force One? Totally unreadable. Break uh, United 1224. Uh, just uh, confirm you're on the localizer. Or do you need a uh, heading to rejoin? Looks like you're a little north of the. No, I've got localizer. I've actually got both diamonds right now. I'm about to start sending. United 1224. Roger. Thank you. Very short final. United twelve twenty four. Thanks for your help tonight, sir. You can go ahead and contact the tower now. One one nine point five. Have a great night. One one nine point five. United twelve twenty four. Have a great night, sir. Thank <laughs> you. 
Holy freaking crap. What? The tower. What's going on? I can't hardly understand a word he says. He, he's worse than Vancouver last night. Oh, is he like... <laughs> tower, Houston Center. Houston Center uh, no, 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 not that bad. He's like in between no. that and like lucky. Break, break. Uh, American 123, Roger. Uh, do you by chance have charts on board? I do. Which approach would you like me to try to me? Yeah, if it, if you can switch around to the driller four, that'd really help me out. I'll take a listen to it. I'll be the second two. I'll pop that in there and I'll let you know. American one twenty three Roger. Uh, just let me know if you have any trouble with that. I'll give you a vector. Is that? But yeah, we switched over to uh, West Flow a little while ago. By the way, okay, so worst landing ever. Watch and, out for uh, wind shear on the. On the end there, I'm landed with the American landing rate of 443 feet per minute. Romeo, Ooh, there's a windshield. Yeah. Yep. Uh, hey, you may want to make her wind shear. Wind shear. Wind shear. Roger, I get that. Too low. Guess, terrain. All right, I guess I'll go ahead and report it. Yup. Yup. Southwest 420, turn left heading 220. Left heading 220, southwest. United 518, contact Houston on approach now, 120.05, have a great night. 20.05, have a great night, United 518. Southwest 420, you are five miles from Hasdo, turn left heading uh, 340, correction, turn left heading 160, maintain 3000 until established, clear to ILS, you're going 1 2 right approach. Clear to ILS, 1 2 right, we'll turn left heading 130, we'll maintain 3000 until established, we'll move wide or something. Southwest 420, thank you, sir, it'll be a left turn 160, that should give you a pretty decent intercept there to 1 2 right. Alright, sorry about that. One six zero something. No worries. Tuned in. Guy West, uh, sixty five fourteen. Thanks for your help this evening. You're number two on the arrival. You can contact the tower now. One one nine or point five. He literally just ignored me when I said wind shear. Alright. Like I told him, I, I said, hey, company in front of me reported that uh, wind shear on finally. He's like, yeah, no, you're good to land. Uh, company's on the taxiway. Yeah, no, the guy's a student. Give him a break. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. 443 minutes. Oh my gosh, 443 foot. That was horrible. I'm really upset. <laughs> Shut up. I know. Exactly, watch me come in. No. This guy was 6514, we're number 2 on the ILS 1-1. Skyway 6514, runway 11, please land, follow United 124, line 1. 
my ears. I have one one clear to land, we'll follow you next. Told you. <laughs> United 111, you're cleared to land, runway 10 left, contact me on the street. Let's dude, shut up. Skyway 3 number 2 for landing, uh... Yeah, number 2 behind the United, uh, Skyway 6514. We're out here vacating when possible. Yeah, it's open for. Uh, Tower, this is November 8373 Kilo. We'd like a radio check, please. Oh, our station calling for the radio check. Uh, you are 555. Thank you, sir. Part of your next to my company. Uh, 1224, join the company of the Echo. Roger, join the company of the Echo, 1224. It's been a while. Who's the uh, CRJ coming up on final? This guy was. That oh, was okay. it. I believe. Yeah, that is the Sky West. Please take a gate. Does it show as daytime in your simulator? Evening for me. Okay. It's night for me. It's only even uh, because I said it about. Oh, that's weird. It's showing his daytime for some reason for me. Alright, I'm watching this now, watching Nader come in. Oh my god. Skyway 
Brand, Brand um, man, did you, did Nader, you try to say something? Nader, that was beautiful. Did you try to say something, uh, Brand, man? Uh, I was trying to figure out what the tower said. Oh, you said, oh my god. Oh, yeah, because Air Force One is on the tower now. Oh. Yeah, did the controller just ignore him again, or did he, uh... Yeah, no, he just flat out ignored him. <laughs> Where to next? Bed. Oh, I thought we were doing another one. I mean, you guys can if you want to, but I got... I gotta go out 100 degree heat for three hours tomorrow morning, so I gotta go to bed. Oh, what are you doing that for? Band. Hey, Jason. Yeah. Yeah, Nader Parker next to us. We're off to your right. Wow. That would have that would have made a nice little screenshot for the end too in your video. Nice little thumbnail. Sorry, man. My landing was greaser though, so That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Gator, that was really good. Gator. <laughs> man, I wish mine name? was. Oh my my mine was beautiful. I love mine. I had and I had no issues with wind too. I mean I didn't really? know anyway. Yeah, I have no idea what you were what you were getting, but I had no issues with wind, even with you right, coming in right before me. It was like an automatic direct tailwind, man. I was coming to land, I flared, and then I got huge, just random boost, and I just crashed into the runway. Wow, felt like I was landing at Sabo. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna be looking for that on YouTube, Nader. You were not, you felt like none of us. All right, sounds good. Huh? Gonna be okay. Heck, this is a good screenshot right here, just me and you, Nader, uh, ExecuJet. Would be nice if, you know, we had the videographer with us. Nader Gator. like that name, it's... Alright, I'm gonna just go ahead and shut down, so if Tower tells me anything, tell him I'm shut down, I can't hear anything. I'll tell the Tower to go kill himself. Okay. That's a little out there. <laughs> All right. What? Is anyone else flying with us for a different flying, or is it just going to be like nothing? Well, the gator is down. So, anyone else? I'm, I don't know. It's feel I'm, like another flight tonight, man. I mean, I'm done. <laughs> yeah. Well, you can't do it with two people. If you do it with two people, then you have to do a shared cockpit. That's just, it's just the thing. Yeah. How do you even get shared cockpit to work? I don't, I don't know how you get it. You to have work. to, you have to go into a, into a multiplayer server that allows shared cockpit. And then share. Yeah, but how do you get to work on Oh, um. One of you has to connect normally with a with a call sign, and then one of you connects as an observer with the same call sign, but just put a, an uppercase A at the at the end of it. So, like for me, if we were to share, if me and you were to share a cockpit, I would come in as United Twelve Twenty Four as the pilot. You would connect as an observer, United Twelve Twenty Four Alpha. Nope. And then I would just spawn in with you, or how does that work automatically? And then. Oh, that, that way both of us can hear the radios, both of us can respond, and we're in the same plane, but you won't show up on radar. Oh. But how do I see, like, the plane? How do I get in the plane? I, I don't know how that works. Oh, that's that's easy. I mean, you just, like I said, you just get on a multiplayer server that allows share cockpit, and there you go.
Like, have you ever watched any of Air Force Pratt videos where he uh, does a shared cockpit with Austin? Yeah, he says it's, 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 yeah, he sets up his own Steam server. Who? On that, so where he uh, Well, I guess I'm going to call it a night, too, and I'm going to go play The Sims or some random childhood game. Yeah. <laughs> Since Brand Man had to, like, ruin the fun. And... Oh, well, okay, I'm sorry. I have to get up early tomorrow. Yeah, that, that's that's ruining the fun. Okay, yeah. I'll be, on, I'll be on tomorrow night about this time, too. All right, I'll be on all week, probably. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Same here before school starts back up again. Then, uh, yeah, good. Well, don't remind me. I have senior year. Oh, <laughs> welcome to hell. <laughs> um, I have I have one more year of high school, then I have at least three years of college. Kill me now. What are you going to go into, Brandon? Vet school. Oh, you I suck. Have, oh, I well, more. Well, vet vet tech school, not really full vet school. I'm like, oh, he's vet gonna go into school. this really <laughs> this really awesome profession. No, I'm gonna be a vet. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, You'd be a is, vet. That is a really awesome profession. No, I'm just playing with you. Without my vet, I don't know what I would do. <laughs>